severe weather. And the interesting thing is, is really severe weather could come up here in the next couple of weeks. I mean, we're into March now already. And one of the things that a lot of people don't, I think, realize is when we talk about risk levels. Take a look. During severe weather season, the Storm Prediction Center periodically issues risk levels to alert you to potential severe weather in your area. The three levels are slight risk, moderate risk, and high risk. However, a great deal of confusion surrounds these government terms, which actually all indicate some form of severe weather is likely. You see, even a slight risk actually means that well-organized severe storms are expected. They're just expected in smaller numbers or coverage, and there's only a small chance of a significant severe event. A moderate risk means a greater concentration of severe storms are expected and in greater magnitude, with a better forecaster confidence that this will happen. Plus, the chance for a significant severe outbreak is increased. Then there's a high-risk day when a major severe storm outbreak is expected with a large coverage area of violent tornadoes. This is reserved for the most extreme events and isn't always issued every year. Of course, we were in that high risk day when all of this happened a year ago on March 2nd, 2012. And, uh, well, we all know what happened then. So we'll be back uh, at 6 o'clock with another look at the forecast. But, Julie, got a couple of words. All right. Thank you, Steve. It has been four.